exciting, especially how it ended like that, having it us up like 10 points a half and then coming down to two points with what, a minute left, I believe. And then with me icing at the end, a real good victory. Yeah, we were trying to run fast break, like after they make, make a basket, we tried getting the ball in bounce as quick as possible and just run down the court, hopefully get them tired. Because they have such a small roster, it'd be easy for them to get tired. And for us, we have more subs and we could run longer. So. That and we tried getting them to a foul trouble so we hopefully get them on the bench longer, which ended up getting the right fouled out. I would think so because everybody was predicting bat or Pembroke to be the top team in the league right next to Oakfield. And for us to come into Pembroke and beat them like that, I believe that they'll think that we're in the top few at least instead of the mid lower from what the early predictions were. Oh, I don't know. I was just praying it would go in when I shot it. It looked good. I was just hoping that the rest would finish. I don't know, I kind of saw it come close to me and both arms were like this. So I was like, oh, I'll just grab that real quick. That's pretty much it. Yeah, I think that um, being with Derek and me and Tate been having two years playing with him, uh, we kind of like get a lot of tension and learned a lot. So we know how to play without him whenever he got in like foul trouble last year. I think that kind of helped us a little bit. And I think teams are going to recognize us and respect us now. Yeah, it does. Uh, like I said to you before, we played mid lakes there, and we played real good man-to-man -man defense. And we came in here, and that's what I wanted to do. And we did the first half, but we got ourselves in foul trouble, and then Wright and Babcock started hurting us. So we went into a zone, and then uh, I think guy Gabby there, he hit us, from, hurt us from three. So I was switching back from man-to-man -man and zone, and uh, I think in the end we ended up zone. It worked well for us. They, one of our keys was rebounding, and in that first half for sure, we gave them one shot, and it wasn't going in for Pembroke, and uh, we rebounded. Uh, Brian Thompson had a, a real big game for us, the biggest, he's a senior this year, and that's the best game he's played for us. Hopefully he'll continue to do that. But I was happy in the end to see uh, Dupuis step up and hit that three to put us there high, because just in the play before it, um, <laughs> I was... Uh, yelling at him down the court for playing defense without watching the ball. And then he turns around and comes out and he has a nice block and he hits a three and that was big for us. Yeah, we actually, when I call that timeout, we, we ran a couple of plays for him especially. One on one, hopefully driving down the middle and dishing off. Well, he never got the dish off. He just took it by himself and put the jumpers in himself. Uh, especially to bring our team together more. And we played as a team tonight and, we, and that's the way we have to play. And it was good to see that.